Wrigley Field's magic is conjured up by how it looks, feels, and is remembered by generations of fans. Your first ball game as an eight-year-old. You walk into the ballpark, you have this emotional rush. Those memories, the imprint, all that stuff gets embedded in, into what you think about the ballpark. It's like a physical trigger for an emotional reaction. That, that, that's a lot of what had to be saved. To preserve the essence of Wrigley Field, the design team identified iconic features that would be untouchable during the renovation. The marquee, the ivy, the shape of the outfield, and the manual scoreboard. Those are seen as being what make Wrigley Wrigley. They're in every photograph of every kid that was ever in there. Okay, whenever we have something that requires us to alter these, the answer has to be no. And then that leaves us with the rest of the canvas to work with. Five years after the Ricketts promised to save Wrigley Field, the Cubs broke ground. Not only will you see a preserved and improved Wrigley Field, but in that ballpark, you're going to see better teams and championship baseball. I think we had a plan in place that we liked. We got the project rolling. And then it was all just, let's keep our fingers crossed and hope that, that it's not more complicated than we think it will be. Was it more complicated than you thought it would be? Of course it was more complicated than we thought it would be. <laughs> If you're watching this, click the subscribe button now.